Okay, this is Kastrup Fortress, which is, um, well, it was built in 1886-1887, as you can see. This is the only port part that's really remaining. Uh, yeah, basically you can just climb up on this hill up there, and there's a couple benches and garbage cans and whatever. Um, but yeah, there's really not a whole lot to see. Uh, it's on a little island which is surrounded by a moat, and it was used by the Germans in World War II, and then was an internment camp for German refugees after that, so that's fun. Uh, there's a bit of information over here. Sorry, it's a bit complicated with the blind cane, but I will make my way as best I can. Um, my blood sugar is very low right now, so... I'm probably not making a ton of sense. Uh, I drank a 500 milliliter bottle of uh, Faxicondi, which is uh, Denmark's most popular soda, which has um, dextrose in it. So, I mean, that's good. So, fruit sugar, basically. But, yeah, this is the Kasimatan, which is, um, yeah, basically just telling you what I just did. Uh, there is the little island that we're on, which is really nothing, and there's a king dude, or soldier guy, I guess, but, yeah, there's my Dexcom alarm, sorry about that, but I just ate, um, a bunch of little muesli bars and drank the soda, so, I mean, I should be fine, it just takes a while to come back up, and I have some more muesli bars and soda in my bag, so should be more than okay but yeah this is a nice little place um it's only about a 15 minute walk from my apartment so it's not bad but i'm kind of a nerd and i like historical stuff so that's fun i'm not sure what that little shed is it might be a public toilet i'm not sure but it's a thing uh but yeah honestly it's not that exciting this is pretty much it there's a restaurant on the other side of this little or actually it's quite a big hill but yeah access to the island is on a little footbridge that you can go to to get to the restaurant and that's nice and everything but yeah it's not all that spectacular there's a lot of people just walk their dogs and their babies and do that <laughs> So, I mean, good for them. Um, there's a little bit of nature going on, but not a terrible amount. So, I mean, that's basically it. And everything's all paved and everything, which I guess it would have had to been, had to have been for the army transport stuff, I guess. I don't know. My brain is just kind of in the process of shutting down at the moment. So, <laughs> this is not the most informative video in the world. But it is a thing. Oh, there's a handicapped access toilet over there. So, I mean, that's lovely. I'm being completely honest there. I'm not trying to be sarcastic at all. That's a beautiful thing that they've done is to have that. And there's the ladies area and the gentleman, I'm assuming, is over on that side. So, good for you, Copenhagen. I mean, that's really a good thing that they do for people so uh yeah it's kind of a pretty tree and I just hadn't made any videos for quite some time so yeah I I don't know I mean the fortress there is cool to see but you can't get in obviously I mean maybe at some point they open the doors for something. I don't know what that would be, but yeah. You cannot get to it at the moment. So, and there are some um, apparently children's playgrounds over on the far side of the island over there, but I don't feel like walking to them. I'm sure it would help for Pokemon Go, but there are a few stops over on that side, but I don't care that much and also my sugar's low so I don't wanna <laughs> that's about it but this is 
a thing to see in Copenhagen. I mean, it's not the most exciting of all the things you could go see, but it's a thing. And yeah, apparently there's some walking pads over there, I'm sure. Uh, yeah, but I think I'm just going to end this here because I'm just going to go around the other side of the island and maybe sit down for a little bit, have another muesli bar and maybe some soda, and then walk my ass home because... I do not need to be out here walking. I can't believe I climbed up that hill. Like, there's a staircase on the other side <laughs> that's very, very steep, and I walked up that thing, and I felt like I was going to die by the end because I'm so out of shape, but yeah, so that was fun. And there's the island's main restaurant, so I mean, I'm right beside where the bridge to get up or the little footbridge, I guess, to get over on the island is. Um, it's surrounded, the entire island, I think, is, I think Wikipedia said it was five hectares. So, it's not like a ginormous island, but it's surrounded by a two to three meter deep uh, moat all the way around. So, defensive. Um, yeah, but it's pretty cool stuff. And... This video makes absolutely no sense, and I am so sorry for that. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna try to find my way back home. Because I don't feel so good. And I don't know if that's a footpath or just what is going on, but it looks kind of precarious. And I don't trust it. Oh my god, Dexcom. I get it. I'm low. <laughs> At least it's not a straight down arrow anymore. And I did have some stuff, so... Oh great, I get to ascend stairs again. But that'll be fun. And there, I don't not sure if you could see it, but that little fence there is the staircase I ascended to get up to the <laughs> what I thought was the fort in the beginning. I guess it was the top of the fort, but you could sit on top of it, so that's kind of nice. And there were some people with doggos, so I did not pet any of them, nor did I say hi, but yeah. Okay, so I'm just going to end this because it's just me babbling in a low blood sugar manner. Um thanks diabetes but <laughs> yeah uh okay um if i see anything else cool in copenhagen um, i just felt like i needed to get out and explore because i've just kind of been going to classes at the university and hanging out in my apartment for the past two weeks which is boring um but my birthday is this week so i think i might go see the t-rex display at the natural natural yeah I was going to say national, but it's not the National History Museum. It is the Natural History Museum. I might go see that. But yeah, I'm going home now. So have a great day, everybody.